Hi guys, it's Becky. If you're new here, then welcome. And if you're already subscriber, thanks for coming back. Today, I'm going to be doing a plan with me in my N1 sterling ink. So the standard size sterling ink vertical spread planner. I'm just going to pull it out of its little case so that I can lie it flat. Um, I've decided as well... Oh, excuse me, a bacon powder. I've decided as well to use this from the Modern Journaler. I have got a discount code, it's Rebecca15. Um, and it's like a little, like, this bit doesn't go with it, but it's like a little set. Like, it all goes together. And, like, with a little colour palette and things. And it's, I just, I don't know. And the boxes, I think, fit actually inside the boxes, which I think that, is amazing I don't understand why these two are um, glossy and this one's matte I don't know if she's just sent me different ones because this was um, she sent me she let me pick out some goodies and then she sent me them so but I do need to go and order more because her shop is amazing I am going to be using my um, trusty paper test designs weekly that we had and yeah I'm just gonna get into it so how is everyone how have you all been um i've been fine now i need to decide this week is going to be quite task heavy so the kids are back at school and we have the normal school schooling routines so i think i'm gonna go till half seven so I can write, you know, reoccurring, reoccurring tasks like the school's activities and things like that. Um, 7.30. So I'll do that at the top. Um, I will use the sidebar as I used it last week. But I can put, let's put, let's pick a sticker to go up here. I love them all. I'm going to go with, which one? I'm going to go with this one. Oh, it's clear. Okay. I'm not going to go with that one. I thought these were glossy. They're not. They're clear. Which is fine. Absolutely fine. But I'll use a matte one for the top. I think I'll go with this one. Because I want to cover just the calendar bit. I have no need for the calendar up there and it just gives the page a little bit of colour. Now I'm thinking of using 992. Is it 992? I think it's 992. Very popular pen of mine to do the boxes. No, I'll do the boxes as they are, right, tasks. Sorry, I'm I'm still getting used to this kind of like layout and what I want it how I want it to be. But I do know that the amount of time I'm giving myself seems to be enough so this one was from 7 till 6 this is from 7 to 8 so I'll give myself till 6.30 because like I said I do know that that's like a good amount of time to do like some some uh, what I get up to in the day and then obviously I've got my daily pages I'm thinking you know that next year I'm not going to have because I'm so far behind in my memory planning in here and I love I love looking back at them you know years to come I love flicking back at them and they're so pretty and and everything but I'm like I've only done up until the um 12th to the 18th of February in here but I just love looking at them the same way as I love looking at the weeklies in here but there are a lot more like um, monochrome in here aren't they and there are a lot more um, functional neutral not as many stickers so we're going to do this all the way across And then all the way down. This is going to be my tasks. There are quite a few tasks this week. And Chris goes on Saturday. Oh, 
I'm dreading it guys I'm absolutely dreading it so he's going away on exercise for four weeks so a month uh, he's going to Estonia which I think is on the border of Ukraine which isn't filling me with uh, masses amount of um, hold on a second film edit oh, thumbnail upload schedule Instagram and then here we've got Monday Tuesday Wednesday Thursday Friday Saturday Sunday let's box it off yeah so four weeks solo with the kids to say I'm petrified would be an understatement these oh went into the back of that cover yeah to say I'm petrified is an understatement I am um, I'm so scared I'm so scared that mentally I'm not going to be able to cope that it's going to break me that you know all the hard work I've done to get to a place where you know everything's okay where I can you know do stuff right so let's write in what I wanted to do so I wanted a paper test designs weekly times two I have done that and then we've got this one a sterling ink and one I've got to start a haul I want to do my quarter one favorites like my stationery and stuff I do want to do a memory plan with me and then I'm not going to tell you what that is and I've got another one um, and I think like, if I just leave that much room for an extra two I think that would be fine so this can be my review And then I'm just boxing them off so that I can. But that can be a review. And then I can use one of them as a highlight. And then meals. Um, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, so yes, if I go Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, because in my, um, in my paper test designs, I write down everything that, um, we can have, and then in here, I like to write down what we do have, so what will be on the 22nd? What did I have? What did we have? So it's Tuesday. What did I have yesterday? Oh, I had microwave meal. Because we are on Tuesday again. I'm behind on setting this up. Um so we want to do down here saturday sunday friday thursday wednesday tuesday monday that is gonna be like skincare and then i want to do another one Saturday, Sunday, Friday, Thursday, Wednesday, Tuesday, Monday. This is going to be like reoccurring things. <laughs> like journaling and um, there are some other things that I want to make sure that I'm doing daily that aren't necessarily 
things there so like last week I added them in here and I didn't mean to so journaling washing I need to make sure I'm doing daily uh, calligraphy uh, read um, I have bought a new book it's called um, the artist's way it's a 12 week like course book um, and I'm really looking forward to that so uh, stories on Insta and Reels so they're things that I need to make sure I do there I need to do my skincare my teeth make bed get dressed hair and makeup but I just want to make sure that I am doing these things I didn't get what well, I did and then I got changed again I didn't do my hair or my makeup I have done my skincare this morning and my teeth I haven't made my bed I haven't got dressed on some pajamas I did brush my hair but well I suppose I brushed my hair yesterday as well so that is that right so let's put something <laughs> oh Kobe what's the matter gonna put this is really cool actually because it says this one says art is uh, simplicity chaos is key and because I've bought the artist way book I want to put that there and then I am going to be able to put some along the top as well I just need to make sure that I'm putting in the reoccurring tasks so Loki has gymnastics on a Monday and then Tuesday's nothing so Wednesday is medication um, Loki PE Willow multi-sport um, Thursday I don't know why what I do is because we've got builders outside still that Loki is Willow's got PE on a Thursday brownies we have to do spellings, uh, bins out, Friday, Loki has PE, but we're turning Friday into Loki's early birthday, so with Chris going away, we decided that, because Loki's birthday is on May the 4th, which is the following Saturday, so we're letting Loki have his birthday a week early and then on his actual birthday he's asked me to save a couple of presents for his actual birthday and um, Chris goes away on <laughs> Chris goes away on the Saturday right so what I want to do is highlight these I can't highlight these because if I use my ink on my calligraphy pen it um, it what's the word I'm looking for it bleeds through but I can put these clear ones over the top of my calligraphy ones but I'm not going to write my titles in just yet because um, so I'm going to put Loki early I put D for day. I'm going to put a B. It's creeping up like Saturday's creep. Like this week and last week went really, really quick. I guarantee you, next, like the next four weeks is not as quick. Uh, early birthday. He wants to go to jump and Mackey's. And then Saturday, I'm going to box that off as well, Chris leaves, because I'm going to be so sad. Chris leaves, 
for four weeks. I literally though am, um, I've got a, um, I've got a video planned. In fact, it's a twelve week year. But I'm also, so the 12 week year I have tried to do before, it's like a product, it's a goal setting system where you do, um, you get more done in 12 weeks than you do in 12 months. But alongside that is the Artist Way book that I've bought and it's a 12 week course. So I'm going, I want to start both of those like on Monday, this Monday, the, the Monday after he goes, so the 29th. So hopefully, um, I'm trying to keep myself as busy as possible. Right, so what I'm gonna do is write the titles here in calligraphy. So I get my little cheat sheet out. This I got from the internet. These are screenshots that I took from, oh my God, I can never remember. Um, I need to, I need, I need to uh, give her founder. She's Cursive Archives on Instagram and just look. I mean, my click feed is not up to that standard but her feed is just absolutely stunning uh, so i've wrote her name down there now but these are like inspirational pictures i took from her so i'm going to just write in the titles and then i will be back so that's all the calligraphy written down so let's have a look what we've got where's here it is i love these love these so i'm gonna put i'm gonna go with the green and i'm just gonna put that on this to separate those and then i'm thinking do i want to put like something down here maybe this one that i did pull up earlier i can fit down in this corner down there i just want to bring a little something something to the page do you know what i mean i love these little quotes so tuesday i'm trying to be productive so i'm going to put this focus right at the top yesterday wasn't the best day and i had to have a little lie down so I could put one of these down because I know I had a nap. Oh, what do I use? I'm going to go with this one, you know. Because I did have a little nap. And I've got focus. I love these colour palettes. I also bought these in as well, but they're a bit big. I'm not going to have absolutely, I'm not going to have anything there. So what shall I put there? Quote for paper that was created to create. I know I'm going to want to. I love this. Dream, inspire, create. Let's put you... There, we need to put something in there. Um, should we use this one? Oh, I love that. I love it. Still, like, literally loads left. It can do so many weeks worth. I'm thinking of putting an another, because that's clear, let's that we've used that one. Let's use this flower and put it right down the bottom here. And then I'll put studio time on Sunday as in like I can use that for planning time. And then these can be spread out in the gaps. 
that I have. Uh, do I want to put a black one there? I suppose I could do to use it up. Put it there. Yeah, I think I'm, I genuinely think I'm happy with that. And I've still got, it was these three sheets, which I can use next week or use on another week. I just, yeah, I love it. I genuinely am loving how it's turning out. I didn't think I'd like doing the little review as well, but I actually genuinely do. So we can fill some of this in because I did do all of that. I didn't put it on Instagram. I'm filming this now. Uh, tasks. Um, so journaling yesterday. Yes, yes, yes. I didn't read I did stories, I don't think I did a reel, and I've done that for today, and then I'll copy my tasks in, and that'll be this all good to go. Like, I love it, I love using this kind of dashboard board layout, and just being very, like, minimalistic, with, that was the word I was looking for, minimalistic. Yeah, so basically <clears throat> there are going to be videos coming that are about the 12 week year and about the book The Artist Way. So the 12 week year I've got, now I didn't buy the, um, the reading book of this, I bought the workbook and I found that it gives you more than enough information in the actual workbook to understand and to be able to do the 12 week year so if you want to join me in this 12 week like i'm not going to call it life transforming or anything but they always say it's good if you have an accountability partner so if anybody would like to join along in this 12 week uh, year program or the 12 week artistic way uh, artists way definitely watch some youtube videos about it because it sounds interesting and a couple of things i want to mention about it is that um i mean if you're not interested in this part then you can just leave and i'll see you in the next video and thanks for watching um it's one it's um very gaudy well not very gaudy but spiritual but it does say you don't have to be spiritual in any which way at all this is the artist way to do it uh, you could change the word it can be for people that like manifesting or spiritual uh, people in different ways or not spiritual at all like a complete atheist can read it and still do the practices in the book it's a 12 week course book so there is a lot of like homework each week a lot of it is where morning pages actually originated from and i have watched quite a few videos and the transformation from when they start to they finish is absolutely amazing especially in regards to morning pages um yeah so if you're interested in doing that along with me then um buy the books and we can when i do the video um we can do it together so yeah that's all i wanted to say on this one so if you enjoyed watching me do this plan with me then um thank you very much and if you want to go and check out the modern journaler use my discount code rebecca 15 which will be down below it's 10 or 15 i'm sure it's 15 which is a bloody good discount so yeah i will see you in my next video guys thanks for watching bye